Happy 20. Woo! Yes. Yes, man. Yes. Yes. I wonder what the the, the percentage of people that get to 20. There, That's the one stat I've heard. And I think it's Alex Hermosi. I don't so, know if it's yeah, where he saw it, but yeah. it was it, when he talked about podcasting, he was like, 20 is the number? Yeah. That's awesome. I think it's like 1% get to 20 or that's something. That's awesome. So we're here. Um, I can't wait for 100. Almost there. And it's been a, it's been an awesome ride with the breadsticks. I feel like we've gotten to know them. I feel closer I with so, the breadsticks. Mm-hmm. If you know if you're tapping in week in week out, we love you. We appreciate you. Love y'all. Just getting started. Yeah, we're just getting started. We're just freaking getting started. Um, classic Thursday episode. Yeah. I, I, by the way, I've been thinking maybe we just. I, I, I've got the segment bug. I've I've had a couple ideas, and I think we're gonna start implementing them. Some soon. new segments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, because yeah. yeah. I, I we're now we ha- we had the hang of it, mm-hmm. but now I think we could start having expand a little bit. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Um, but yeah, but, we got MVLV rookie confesh. We got news. We got questions, and it's it's the news. Uh, we didn't we didn't yeah. mention it before, but we'll get into it this time. Uh, do you want to start with your with your MV today? Yeah, I could kick it off. Um, oh, this has to do with you, actually. This has to do with you. I love. I that. have an MVC. Do you think you actually? I think you have a shot at getting it. MVC. Most valuable car. No, Damn uh, it. it's most valuable complimenter. Wow. Do, you, do you know what I'm talking about yet? Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. So I so I got a new shirt. All right, I got a new shirt. Um cool Nike shirt. Nothing like insane. It's a good shirt. It's a good tee. It's it, a good tee. Danny, you're being you're you're, you're being it's humble. A plus tea. You're being humble, man. I like it, the shirt a lot. You think it's like a shirt of the year candidate, right? A hundred percent. I was so gonna yeah, say that. So yeah, you um you complimented it, but it but that's not where it ends. Like you so I got it, I put it on, just you know, we work throughout the day, so I threw it on in the morning. Right. And that was that was my shirt for the day. Mm-hmm. Um, he said, nice shirt. It was first thing he said to me that morning. He said, and, nice shirt, right? Yeah. And, and that was a new shirt, correct? New shirt. Brand okay. new shirt. Yeah. So you said, nice shirt in the morning. Um, and then I popped in my room. I think I edited some stuff. You edited, popped out like an hour later. And it was like, yo, that shirt really is, is something, right? So that's, and that was two. And I wasn't lying. You weren't lying. The then second we, time, by the way. First time I meant it, second time. You meant cemented it. it with the second time. Yeah. And then I think we like went to the court. You were like, that shirt, man. That shirt. And it was all but Danny, I was just I, it was catching my eye every yeah. single time. <laughs> yeah, it was hitting you each time. And it, then I think that I think it was probably like six to seven. Like mm-hmm. when we went to film yep. our regular set, I was like, dude, nice shirt. And and I, I like it because you don't you're you uh you don't like talk you don't talk much. No, no, no. Right. So like if you're if you're gonna compliment so that if you're gonna let somebody know, <laughs> you're gonna let them know. So like yeah. that was you complimented that shirt, yeah, like six to eight times in one day. Listen, and that's just how I felt at the time. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I mean, listen, I think they might it might not have popped on screen. You know, no, like, I think like, it's a I good think, and we'll I, we probably already popped it up. We'll pop it up again. Yeah, yeah. It I think it pops. I'm, I'm not it saying pops. it doesn't pop on screen. I'm I'm just saying in person it's it, it it's really something. Right. It, right. It's a it's a shirt that you have to get out and see um yeah. with your own eyes because it, it, it's really it's a do special you want your shirt, own man. should I get you your own copy or you want me to just do my thing with no, it? No, and, and that's not even about it's not about that. I know sometimes yeah. I'll do that. Sometimes I'll compliment something just wanting it. You know, yeah, and, yeah, yeah, and you'll have it the next day. And that's right, typically right. in the food space, though. I would, yeah, I'd say yeah, yeah, if, yeah. if you if you hear me complimenting, you know, a candy you got. Um, sure. Yeah, you'll have it. You'll have it. Yeah. I, I'm, I I'm, saw you got in, got into Sarah's peanut butter M and M's. You got into those. Yeah. I, and listen, I, I actually backed my way into those. I didn't even mean it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. You I, told I, me. Have you you know about these? I think that's what you said. To yeah. Me about <laughs> yeah. about M and M's in my room. And because yeah. because we were sifting for something and and sifting I, for scissors or uh, was it scissors? It was, it was a tape. I was a tape. We were sifting for tape and you and you stumbled upon some peanut M and M's. And those are really good. Yeah. That, peanut that, butter. That, peanut butter. They're not peanut. Yeah. Do you like them over peanut? It's really close. It's really yeah, close. Yeah. Um. Yeah, no, but that I mean, listen, that shirt is really special, Danny. And thank you, I, and thank I, think, you. I appreciate that. Now, now, what's your what's your um, what's your stance on like bringing that shirt back out? Because like you, you, it's you, tough. It's tough. There's yeah. eyeballs now. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I probably can't play them for another month on screen. Yeah, right. It's got to be at least a month. I think I could play them at a workout, maybe like an orange. Because I don't think I went to yeah. Orange Theory that day, so I yeah, think yeah. I could play them. He could play off screen once, and then I already told him he won't play on screen for about a month. And that, and he should understand because he played in a full set of ten videos. Like you're, you're oh, not, he he played in a, a long yeah, set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and that's the problem with these shirts. These and nice I sent is, him. He got a couple comments actually, some good comments. I sent him screenshots, and he loved it. And um, yeah, listen, the uh, the thing is, like, uh, he should be expecting screenshots every time he's worn. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think it's tough for some for for shirts uh, that play in our systems because we do play on screen a lot. So mm-hmm. we we got to cycle these guys. They can't play every week. They it has to be minimum a month. It, it and has that's something when you sign with our camp. Like you can't play all the time, and and that, that's a reality of of what it is. And I think most kind of buy in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you get to play on screen. Not every shirt gets to play on social media. True, right? and, and true. that's what young shirts always. It's want. just you like they're on social. 
So it's like exactly, yeah. you know, it's like, do you want, do you want one time on screen, or do you want, you know, you want to be a starter on a, on a, yeah, yeah, on, yeah. A, on in a closet? <laughs> yeah, I mean, that, you could you, for our dad, you could play every day, and and he, he and plays he, two, I think he, he plays, plays two shirts. He, I think he has like five starters. Yeah, and they, and he rotates them through like a pitching rotation, mm-hmm. um, but they don't play on screen. So yeah. it's it's a give and take. Yeah, and I know shirts that are really happy with Macarena. Yeah. I'm oh, sure I know. I think really he, I think him. he's got he's got a really nice system over there. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. He, they got an, they got a short lifespan over at they his do. over at his system. They, they'll they'll go they'll come into the closet uh, and they'll be out of the closet twelve months later. Yeah, and it's yeah, pretty. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. like clockwork. It's, yeah, it's really yeah. like that yeah. for him. Um, and they got goodwilled or something like that. Where they get goodwilled, they get trash bagged, and, yeah, and they get yeah. sent off to a you know a, a better a better system. Yeah, um, where they get more minutes. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. No, but I I think that's. Uh, Listen, that that shirt is really special, and I'm I'm glad he got his. his yeah, thank his you, M- and thanks for letting me know eight yeah. times. Yeah, 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 thank yeah. You. yeah, yeah. Um, anytime, man. With my MV, it's going to be an MVP. I actually mentioned it to you. Um, oh yeah, go ahead. I know what it most is. Most valuable it parking. Is. Yeah. Oh, so you just left it at parking? That's cool. That's slick. That's slick. Because I thought you were going to go like parking structure in S. I thought no, you were no, going to no. go PSISM. No need. No need. No need. Okay. Um, yeah. Because Danny, I, I think everywhere in the world. Yeah. I don't know if I'm going too far. You you tell me if I'm if I'm making too much of a statement. Sure. I think the worst the worst thing in the world is parking. Yeah, I like Have that. Have I lied yet? I don't think so. I, I don't think so. I, I don't I, think so. it sucks. It freaking sucks. When you get to an event and you have to park, it sucks. Dude. It freaking sucks. You in have to Santa, figure it out. Yeah, you, you gotta, have to figure you gotta pay. Yes. Yes. In Santa Monica, they just got like ten parking structures, and I didn't know because I do the one by Orange Theory, and I freaking do it every time. It's the best thing ever. It's the best. Sometimes I just park there and walk home and stay there for the day. Like yeah, I keep my car there for the day because I can. Do you? No. Oh, okay. No, but well, I, but you wanted to show him a little love. You wanted yeah, to... I just wanted to. Yeah, and I wish you didn't call me on that because I wanted to show him. My some bad. Love. I my wanted fault. to gas him up my a little bit. But yeah, I thought there was only one. There are. There's parking garages every like like nine hundred feet. It's awesome. And it's, I don't think that's exaggerating. I, it's not actually exaggerating. Yeah, and it's you, awesome. And they're free, pretty much. I think it's like two hours free. Yeah, it's not an hour. It's not an hour. It's, it's definitely at least two. It's definitely over one. I yes, know that. Yes. But okay, yeah. Let me give my MP, MVP out though. Like my my so my most valuable parking is going to go to Santa Monica parking. I don't know yes. if I officially. I don't know. Get like I. I just we need yeah. we need the person over there to be etching the trophy for sure. For sure. Um, it's SM parking. Yeah. It's SM, I'm talking to the trophy guy. It's yeah, yeah. Trent. Trent's doing that. Yeah. Thank you, Trent. Yeah. yeah. SM parking. Looking yeah. good. Thanks, Looking brother. Good. Yeah. Um, Trent's kind of a bummer, honestly. Yeah, I know. I know. I hope he can't he, hear us. Yeah. Yeah. No, he, he can't. He can't. Um, yeah. He no, etched, but he etched some other stuff for us. He he's done etch work for us. Yeah. And the like, thing he's is, just is like, kind of, like he's always angry. That's what I. That's what yeah. I get bothered with about yeah. Trent. Like he's just, he's like he doesn't want to be etching. It's like yeah. Dude, it's if like you, you don't have to, you don't have to etch. You're an not, etcher. Yeah. Like, whatever. That that's beside the point. Yeah. Um, if you go anywhere in Santa Monica, you're you're in, you're out. You didn't pay. And I actually so awesome, am satisfied dude. with that. You put the ticket in and it just lifts it up for you. Yeah. And it gives you that little uh, crooked smile. Little I'm gonna, crooked I'm smile. I'm going to grab a, a picture of that oh, before man. this goes up. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. It's, I think it's a wink. It's a wink. Yeah. It's a wink. And it says, enjoy. Thanks for part. What does it say? Something. Uh, thanks for parking, I think. Thanks for parking with a, <laughs> with a, with a, with a wink. No, thank you. Yeah. Santa thank Monica you. It is garage. awesome. It yeah. Is it's, awesome. It's, it's the best thing that this city has to offer. Yeah. Shout out to, if you're in Santa Monica, you know what we're talking about. Oh, wow. Just am park. I, if you're in here, just park your ass. And my freaking LV just. He had a fit and just hopped out. You see him just hop out of my notebook. I did. I actually did see that. Yeah, he's been being like really. Are we gonna snake or no? Oh, uh, I mean, I think you're. I mean, already... we'll just get this out of the way. He's yeah. been being a real dick all day because oh. I told him he's gonna get wow. the LV. Well, don't um, tell your pens early that they're gonna get LV. Well, he's getting he's getting LV and retired, so we had to talk about it. Oh, yes. Okay. Yeah. So, um, audio only. If if you're listening, it's I got a pen, a Colorado Rockies pen. Um, I do have an LVP. It's least valuable pen. Wow. Um. You know me, I have a lot of pens. Yeah. I have a lot of pens, but I like to uh, I like to play one at a time. I like him to live his life. Pens usually live, you know, two to three months in my system. Um, and then we we send him off um, to retirement. We They prepare for retirement on contracts. So yeah, like, did he have... Um, he didn't have it yet because he's... Uh, well, this is the issue. He's only played for... I started playing him like a couple days ago. Whoa. Um, and I bought him, you know, at a, a farm system game. Or no, spring training. Mm. I bought him at a spring training game. Mm. And I was like, you're going to you're gonna play for the next couple months. And yeah. he, ran, he ran out of ink like a weekend. And that's the problem with these pens, man. They, yeah. they gas two, out. Not even a week, three days in. I mean, you can't, you can't, you can't just ink out. You can't ink out a well, month into your contract. It's not, it's not the issue with these pens. It's, it's gift shop pens. Yeah. It's yeah. gift shop pens. Yeah. I'm afraid you're right. Um, so yeah, he doesn't, he's, uh, he's getting retired three days in. That's tough. And, um, and you're, and you're mad about that or are you? I'm not mad. He's mad that I like put it on blast. He wanted to just retire yeah. and like go to his, yeah. um, his nursing home and be done. Yeah. Um, 
but I'm I I was like I need to get like it's just it's an LVP. It's what it's yeah, what it doing. is what it is. And listen, at the end and of the day, I, I want to speak out on gift shop pens. They're not they're they're showmen. Yeah, they're no, showmen. Right. They're, they're not they're not ink guys. Well, they're, they're not, not ink guys. Well, they're not competition pens, Danny. And that and that's the thing is like they they'll like to they'll they'll tell you they're competition pens. They're not. They're not competition pens. And I don't know. Do, have you been playing these guys that that mom got us? Well, I actually. This These a, are freaking competition pens. That's a competition pen. Right? Competition this is what a competition pen, pen, this pen is looks what a like. Pen. Right here. No, no logos, no nothing. No nothing. It's a slick pen. Yeah, and, there's and, a lot of ink. He's it. not going to ink out. He's not going to ink out. He's that's what it looks like for me. Yeah, that's um, a pros pro right there. Yeah. So unfortunately, we're retiring him. He's not a Hall of Fame pen, which stinks. Um, I've retired. But a lot every of Hall every of Fame pen pens. can't be a Hall of Fame pen. No, no. Yeah, it would ruin the impact of the Hall. Exactly. Um, but yeah, I have an LVP today. You hate to see it, man. You really do. I'm actually going to snake here. Because I I wanted to just get I mean my rookie is Danny my rookie of the week is this pen, wow and I'll that's get to actually my LV insane after. that we both just did pens man. but Danny just watch this and I and I know this isn't going to be it probably won't come through on camera and watch how if, smooth, you're, if you're audio sorry that we're talking a lot of a lot watch of pens, how smooth this freaking thing is really smooth really, really you want you want you want to do a little right with it really I mean Danny it's the smooth it's the smoothest pen ever, I've ever used Yo, my, I don't could, even could you give you want to give my guys yeah I'm gonna give this guy is freaking smooth this guy knows. Yeah. Oh, that's smooth. Yeah. And this guy's got a little weight to him. Yeah. It's got yeah. a little weight to him. Yeah, brother. Yeah. And um, listen, the, the reason I wanted to give a a, a a rookie to this pen, Danny, is yeah. I, I you know I've been running low on pens. This has been something that I've did been struggling you, with for some um, time now. Did you take him out of my pen bag? No. No, no, no. I didn't. Um, Dad's calling. Should I answer? Yeah. Though he's actually been on the pod before. So. He has been on the pod. Um, here we go. Let's see what he's got to say. Ask him one. Dad, you're on the pod. We want one joke out of you. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Am I really on the pot? Yes. You are, yeah. You're, you already had one joke that landed. So and it, it is... killed. And it killed. And, and there's a lot of pressure because the people freaking, they've been fiending for more. So let's, you're on the spot here. One joke from Pops. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've too many to choose from. Bro. Just do your favorite Run one. one. Run one, brother. This guy does have a really deep and, bag and, of and jokes. Let's, like, don't make it too like graphic or anything. <laughs> like, like keep it PG. I can't do it this time, I guess. Just, <laughs> okay. Uh, All right. You got anything it. you want to say? I'm just, well, I'm, I'm nervous about the Nuggets. Biggest game of the year. Come on. We were just going to big game. Yeah. We, I'm going to punch you both in the face. What did you say? If it's not on the pod, <laughs> I'm going to punch you both in the face. If what's not the, on the, the pod? The Nuggets game? No, I, I agree. And did you see Yoke said it's not a big game? What did he say? He said it's not a big game. That's pretty much what he said. And it, and listen, I, I get what he's saying, and I like where his head's at because like we're just gonna we're in the playoffs and we're gonna win anyways. Yeah, because he just he he's really worried about the NBA Finals. Here. Yeah, but I I I just don't agree that it's not a big game. All right, just ask me the question again about a joke. Okay, um, okay. we're gonna keep all this in. But, yeah, he, uh, he wanted to cut there. He Pops, wanted to cut. Is, Pops is on the. Pop, I, I don't have to reintroduce it. Say say your favorite say joke. Your joke. Guys, this, this, tonight's no 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 time for jokes. We got game 80, game number 80 in Denver, the, the game of the night, 8 o'clock game. I'm not in a joking mood. Right? Okay. Understood. Understood, right. Pops. Yeah. Understood. No. Um, I'll call you after the game, after we win. No, I, I, I'm embarrassed. I didn't come up with a joke. I mean, I know you got material. I don't know why you're not letting one fire. You still can let one fire. You can let one fly here. Let one fly, man. And if you don't like it, we can cut it out. Let me call you back in the car. All right, call me back. You folded. You folded. Well, I'm when he when when he it's called funny, me. You know what's funny is we're not going to cut. Like he wanted a cut to the Nuggets. I think we're going to keep it. No, we'll keep everything. And he thinks, yeah, that's really good. That's funny. But but in like ten minutes, you're probably going to see the the joke from Pops. And by the way, it'll be really funny. It'll be really funny. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's got a lot of good material. The guys, the guys, hilarious. Yeah. Um, if you think anything, we the reason we're funny is just because he's really funny. Um, what were we just talking about? Pen. Um, yeah, but do your you got to do an LV as well, brother. Yeah, my, and I know you were gonna try to just skip over that. You don't like giving out LVs. Bro. I don't like giving out LVs, but we got to do it. Um, I was gonna give out a least valuable option between cold and hot weather, and give it to cold weather because it's been warm and cold weather sucks so bad when you have a couple of days of warm weather. Warm weather is so. Awesome. I didn't know how much it mattered to me. It matters a lot. It does. It matters a lot. It to does because the past couple of days have been warm and my day has been like twenty five percent better. And not I, even three percent. 25 i agree it's and awesome i i think like in the winter when when we're, we've been in santa monica i've been like yeah. damn like we should just live in florida or something or mm -hmm. arizona because because it's not warm 
Because it's not warm in the winter, but then when you get to the summer and every so day awesome. is 72 with so a nice awesome. little breeze, you're yeah. like, oh, wait, this is why we freaking live in Cali. It's the best. Yeah. Um. Okay, but my LV is going to be, I don't know how to phrase it. I'm going to just, LV, my LV, LVB. Least valuable bop it. Damn, really? No. No. Oh, okay. No, no, I would never. Um, least valuable basket. Ball? Least valuable blemish. <laughs> okay, and you I'm just gonna you got I'm gonna go to the pimple. I don't know if they're still like I. I had who's one. who's playing on you right now? Who you got playing? It, it's pretty much gone. I mean, I had I had a big pimple just yeah. Like, oh, it's, it's kind of still there. Do you have a shot of it? Oh, I don't me, have a you shot. Mind, you mind if I get a shot of it for, yeah, for the people get, here? Get, get a shot. I mean, it's it's you pretty much retired. I mean, yeah. I, I spanked him. I, you know, I got really physical with him. I, I yelled at him. I, I intimidated I, yeah, and him. Be careful with that though, because there's a there's a lot going on right now with with, with um. Like pimple. Oh respect. come on! Pimple mental health. Pimple respect. I know. I know that we should respect. You spanked him and you got rough with because, him because because I I didn't what, did invite you, him. Did and you squeeze him? Did you? Yeah, squeeze, I squeezed did you, him. Did you yeah, ooze him? Did you ooze him out? I oozed him. Yeah, that's not going to go. But because well Danny, it's like I didn't invite this freaking pimple. That on my, pimple's going to press. That pimple's going to press charges, no, and then you're going you to regret saying you wouldn't this shit dare. Yeah, all the evidence is here. Is it still there? I mean, we we'll take a look here. I mean, is it that kid? No, it's that kid. Yeah, or, or is that a different one? No, that's my freaking pimple. Yeah. Um, what the hell is that? I mean, yeah, it's. All I right. didn't invite you. I didn't invite you to my face, and right. now you're just on my on my temple. You know, know what I'm saying? You, I know that you invite guys to your face. You only want guys to play in your face. That you invite. I know that about you. I invite pimples to my face. You know that? You invite pimples, and that's it? why that's why I'm annoyed with you saying like like pimple health, like mental. I know health. you're like, a pimple advocate. I understand. Yeah, that. I'm a pimple advocate. I, yeah, I've, I know, in, I know, I've I know. invited several pimples to my face. I know. My, you're right. My, yeah. You're why right. do you think I grow a beard sometimes? I'll, I'll just invite a pimple. You'll invite so him to play stay on, on my cheek. I've heard about that from pimples. I've, yeah, I've li- like real life heard from specific pimples. They said Zach, let me play under his under his beard. I've heard that, and I'll, I'll let them play for like months. Yeah, yeah. Like I, I don't mind a pimple just stopping yeah. in on my face. You also you you really uh you invite mosquitoes to bite you. Because that, itch, cause yeah, well, that, really that satisfying. Yeah. I, I host a lot. Of, I'm a host family for mosquitoes in the summer. <laughs> yeah, and, yeah. and Danny, mosquito season's right around the Cause, corner. Because you enjoy the itch. Yeah, and, and I think everybody, itch. do you not enjoy the itch? I do enjoy the itch, yeah. It's I an awesome feeling. I don't enjoy like the consequence after. of like. What's the consequence? Red bump, red bump. Oh, oh, red. Yeah, I don't like red bump. I don't like red bump, and that's, that's yeah. The I mean, I mean, Danny, I'll, I'll, you got to host. You got to host like on the thigh. You got to host. Yeah, yeah. Do you ever slap itch, or do, <laughs> how do you itch? I, I mean, I, I uh, listen. Or do you, you surround I, sound itch, or you I, direct I, itch? I, I like. Oh, I don't. I don't like the direct itch. I like the surround sound. Surround sound itch. Slap yeah, yeah. itch is a little <laughs> bit much for me, but I'm not going to say it's I a little freaky. Yeah, it's yeah. a little freaky. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, I know you slap itch a lot. Yeah, I slap itch. Yeah. I, I've heard you slap itch, itching, and yeah, I'm like, yeah. I don't even want to go in that <laughs> Does room. Just get really right loud. This guy slap itching is, yeah, is yeah. mosquito bites. And You'll hear weird stuff. Yeah. Yeah. There's yeah. moans. There's. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, obviously followed by well, a slap. It's not moans for me. It's from the bite. I know. The bite will moan. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Um. But yeah, listen, that pimple. What like it's what? not it's not it's a good fun it's actually it's I'll a look, fun pimple. It's, it's a no, fun, I know fundamental pimple is what I was gonna say. Very down the middle pimple. I know that but, guy that guy definitely went to pimple school, went to university. But that's, Danny, that's but, a pimple. Yeah, but Danny, my thing is is what what where where are you coming from? Like who who's who's paying you? Who are you who do you answer to? Right. Is he answering to the fact that we He might be a homeless guy, a homeless pimple. I don't think he is a homeless pimple. So you think he's signed to somebody? I think he's working with somebody. Huh. Yeah, and it's really okay. it's just really interesting. Like, who sent this pimple to my face? Right, right. Because normally I know. Normally I'm like, oh, oh, you know, we- Do you think you have a mole in your camp that's like sending, uh, that's, that's sending pimples? That's what I'm worried about. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm worried about. Because, listen, at the end of the day, again, I've said it once, I say it again. I welcome pimples. Right. If I know where it's coming from. Yeah, so um, my, oh, my rookie is over here. I've been eyeballing. I, I was like, "Is this going to be the MV? Is this going to be the LV? He's what the is this going to be?" Yeah. Um, so my rookie this week is going to be the vanilla Starbucks Frappuccino bottle. That's a really nice bottle, glass bottle. If you're if you're audio only, it's a really nice looking. I'm really trying to be. Um, I'm I'm audio uh, audio only friendly, so I'm just trying to. That's a really out. cool bottle. Yeah, it's a cool bottle. I bet it um, tastes great. It does taste great. Yeah, it's a it's a vanilla frappe. Um, basically, like. I don't know if you've heard my camp and I are trying to do the coffee thing. We're mm-hmm. trying to, so this is, yeah. this is not, I don't even know if this is really even coffee. It's phase one. We're going to go through like five, six phases before we're doing like, oh, yeah, like black coffee. Um, so this is phase one. This is phase one. Oh no. <laughs> I don't, Danny, I don't know what's oh, going no. on. With this Drop it again. Oh no, we're back. We're there back. You go. We're back. Yeah. I mean, I, and if you didn't hear me, Danny, that, that coffee's 
that's a sweet coffee you got there, man. Yeah, and and again, it, it's it's. I um, love that coffee. I'd say it lives more in the the milkshake family. Yeah, I, like yeah. I don't know, I really don't know if there's any coffee. Mm-hmm. In it. Um, but this is phase one. And, I wonder how it tastes. And it's going to be a five to six step process. Um, are you trying to? Hmm. What's up? Because I remember we we're talking about when you compliment stuff. Sometimes you just want the thing. Um, you're not doing that, right? No. Okay. No. But yeah, this is um, milkshake it vibes. Looks like but, it but tastes really is, good. Is all I'm saying. This is stage one. I'm excited to move to stage two, which might be like a vanilla bean at Starbucks type thing. I think, Danny. I, I think how much caffeine's in there? I don't. It doesn't say. Probably like 50, 60. Not a lot. I think you're ready, by the way, for a cold brew at, at Starbucks. Did I do a cold brew the other day? Mm. What did I do? No, no, no. You, you, I you did, did something. A, you did a, a, a uh, just a straight latte, and it was okay. And it was. I okay. mean, Danny, the, the latte that you would just the cold brew is. Should the I same break into this right now? Should I do this yeah. thing? Do you want to try it? Uh, if you're if you're offering, I mean, I would love to freaking give it a go. You want to try it? If you're offering, I mean, I like I, I'm not. Whoa, it, they want it shook. Okay. They want it shook. Oh, wait, so is this, is this your first time trying this? No, 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 I've had it a couple times. Okay. It's it's a milkshake. It's a milkshake. Oh. How about that sound? How about <laughs> That's... Give it a go. I guess we're just going to share. Good. Oh, it's so... Oh, how good is that? That's so good. Yeah, but it's... How much coffee did you get in that? None. There's no coffee in there, but that's that's a really tasty It's got a average. coffee smell to it. That's got damn, that's that, a, that's a damn milkshake, eh? That's gonna win a lot of MVs. Yeah, it's gonna win um, a lot of MVs down the road. So yeah, he's phase one. Maybe he just ends up playing forever. I don't know if I get if I get married to him and right. really don't want to leave this this drink. But yeah, I don't think Danny. I don't think that's the drink that's gonna do it because I don't think he's got the pop for you. The coffee pop. He's Danny. not training. Well, that's why he's phase one. Have you had coffee pop yet? Uh, it's, yeah, it's terrible. I hate coffee pop. Really? Like, oh, you're saying coffee caffeine? Yeah, pop? yeah. Uh. I don't know that I have it's, now. It's it's, it's a different, different than energy drink pop, right? A hundred percent. It I just don't know gets why. you like, like is it like I could conquer the world pop? Yep. I've had that. I had that with like my first energy. Exactly. Drink. Yeah, and you get I it had with that coffee. too. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. The first time I, I think had, we like, talked about this, and it's like you don't want to have coffee too much because you don't want to lose that pop that it has. I can't wait for you to get some coffee pop, but yeah. I don't. So does that like give you a little pickup though? This doesn't even really so because I think I think a, like an energy drink has an energy drink has two hundred. Right. This has like fifty. Right. So I, it doesn't really give me any pop, but it's more so trying to get acclimated to coffee. Yeah. yeah. Um. I think I I got like a I got a pop when I had that thing at the at the office. Oh, that I had already had an that. energy, but I had I was tweaking. I was tweaking too. I had a tweaking pop. I was tweaking so, too. So yeah, that wasn't great. That was but. just I they they had free cold brews and lattes and they were like, and we were you already energy drink deep. And I'm like, of course I want one. Yeah. And we um what are we gonna yeah. say? No? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Of course. Um yeah, I mean that's 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 it for that. Let's get into the news. I mean, I we're we're late on the coal thing, but we're we're early on the other or not early, we're on time with the other shit. So yeah, yeah. coal I don't even I don't even want to talk about it because we're late with we're late with the reaction to the apology. Because we didn't, he apologized like when we put that pot. So he hadn't apologized last pot. It sucks because it's like, it's tough because like, it sucks. But like also he's like happy about it. You think he's happy about it? I, I don't think, think he's I, happy about I it I think at he's all. at peace with it. I think what but happened. It's really bad for, it's a really bad rap career play I feel like. I don't even know. Well, I, maybe it just not. depends on we'll what he wants ages. to do. Yeah. I, I just think the guy released the diss track and then people didn't like it. So then he just deleted it if am i is that, is that not what just happened i, I don't, feel like that's got to be what just happened i mean i think he's saying like he he released it and didn't like how it felt but he didn't say anything mean to him so like it wasn't that mean it really wasn't that mean because other rap beefs are are like out of pocket like, like i think, personal nothing personal was said by either of them i know i'm pretty sure drake and kendrick are gonna say things that are like not cool you think i'm pretty sure Didn't you, and that's another news story that will, we, and we'll get, we get into get that it. next but like even yeah, uh, even think, um you really Pusha. think that's it was reactionary to the inner I I just have a hard time believing. You that. think if he dropped I have a hard that, time believing that he's even tapped in like that to like but I guess you, he probably is. I'm just saying do you think if, if Cole dropped that and and it was like back to back where yeah. everybody's like this is insane and it was going to like go platinum and it's mm-hmm. like you think he's deleting it? I don't think so. I don't it's we'll never know. We'll, we'll never, never know. know. But I also think I mean if he's like what he's missing is th- like the Pusha beef? Yeah. He, the Pusha took it too far. Pusha went too far. He Pusha was like, went. the dude, even just saying that Drake had a kid might have like, that's, I mean, that's, I mean, you impacted that kid's life. That just, the kid's life know. changed Drake's life forever. That for like in, cause of rap beef, which is crazy. Yeah, just cause like you think you're better than him, which yeah, I get. Yeah. Do you think, do you think that was good for Adonis or bad for Adonis? I think it could um, be either. We don't know what, yet. Like Pusha exposing him. 
Because like it depends now on he's like, in the eye because yeah. of Pusha. Yeah, and like I don't know, like I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, it's just like it, it's just crazy that they're rapping and then now we're bringing in like a two year old. It is crazy. It is. It is crazy. But that's the thing with Cole and Kendrick. That had it was nothing like that. There was, it was just like serious. subtle, subtle jabs at like Kendrick's discography. Kendrick was <laughs> like, like, "I'm so, better," and then Dr- and then Cole was like, "I'm better." Yeah, and he was like, "You're kind of boring." Yeah, that's so not and then personal. He's like, Damn, bro, I just I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't sleep with myself. It could have been reactionary to people saying it was like soft. I don't know, dude. But it's it is the worst way it could have gone. It's like don't it's like don't drop the diss or drop it and stand on it. You could like dropping yeah, and just... and backing out is like the worst way to go about it. Yeah, I'm not a fan of it. But yeah, Joe Budden said uh, Drake and Kendrick both have one loaded. That is, I can't wait. Do you think it'll drop this week? I don't think they're. I don't. I think. Or do you think they're like waiting to see if they even want to drop them? I think the other one. Of, the I vault. think Kendrick has to go again. Yeah, I think it's Kendrick's. It's Kendrick's turn. Yeah, I mean it. It is. It is Kendrick, but it's like Drake's not going to now go at Kendrick after Cole like went and pulled back. Yeah, I mean that's that's all I'm saying. I, I think Kendrick's got to be on this Metro album. Do you think like? So do you like Cole the same now, or you're actually like, damn? Oh, I like him the same. But you're just like I just hate that now. Just hate like how it went. You can't. Can you really say? Like the top three, like it, I don't know, I don't know. Now it's just big. It's the it's the big two, and then Cole. So you is think just he removes like, himself from the? the he, well, he just doesn't want the smoke. Like the yeah, co- he, he doesn't, doesn't want the even, competition. Yeah, he doesn't even want to be in there. Yeah, yeah. Which is fine. It's like he's saying that he doesn't want to be in there almost. Exactly by like doing that. Yeah, I think the big three is more. I think it's just like Mickey kind of. No, I think it's the big. I mean, it's kind of different now, but I think it's just yeah. it's Drake, Kendrick, Ye. Drake, Kendrick, Ye. Because people, Ye is still the biggest. So that yeah, actually I is would even true. I would even argue that it's really just Ye versus Drake. Because yeah, the way people like yeah, that's Drake actually true. That's actually the true. same way people like Ye. Where like if you love his music, you that's just all you listen to, and that's that's a, true. Like Kendrick, fan? Kendrick's a different kind of big. Ex- well, he's, he's like just—he's just the—he's like Tupac. He's just like a—he yes. is the Tupac rap big. world. He's the biggest. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Which I mean, I don't know. They're playing two different games. Yeah. But I mean, I—I I hope they just go at each other. I hope they go crazy here. Be, I mean, it'd be entertaining. Um, Nuggets else? game tonight. Big Nuggets game. Huge Nuggets game. I, they're just gonna win. The thing with the Nuggets is when they try, they just—they get the job done. Yeah, they don't like half the regular season. I feel like they don't really unleash yeah they don't i mean i mean but even in this game like yoke said like it's not even a big game yeah so like even even now like we're we're really just locked in on the on the finals and we're gonna probably start talking about the nuggets more than than you guys would even want us to because as playoffs approach yeah because i mean as fans of the the nuggets i mean this is it's a big moment for us huge huge i'm real i'm actually like i'm starting to get a little nervous i'm starting to get butterflies for the for for our playoffs well just like we got to do your, it. Your postseason is starting. Soon. My postseason is starting very soon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I got to lock in. I got to lock and in. And it is like, it's j- like life will be way better if the Nuggets win. Way it's better. A, it's a legit thing. Like, it'll be so awesome if they win, man. I think my life has been way better just being able to, if somebody's just talking basketball. Because you have a ring? Yeah, I have a ring. And, and, yeah, yeah. and if somebody's out arguing with me, it's just like, we are the reigning champs. Yeah, there's really no, there is no argument. So like, There is no argument. We I mean, have the belt. We have we, the belt. We right have the belt. Mm-hmm. I, and I also was saying this to you the other day. It's like, I want to win a second. Yeah. So that we can go for the three-peat. Just, be, just to have the opportunity. Just to, to have the, the opportunity. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. the Chiefs have it, and it's just going to be such a fun year for them. I don't think they're going to do it. And it's like, if we if we lose, it's like, then we have to build for another. It's just, yeah, it takes, it takes long so to long to build there. it. Yeah, yeah. But if we three-peat, we're, we're, I don't know, top five dynasties of all time. Probably. Top three. I mean, you have to be. No, top five. Top five, probably. Yeah. Um, but like even last year, like the Lakers could be were like, oh, like you guys aren't gonna get it done in the playoffs. It's like you can't. Nobody can say that anymore. We did get like it the done. Lakers kind of had the belt coming into like last I, year. We who were we arguing with the other day? Someone was like, I think the Lakers. It was just when we were at the. Oh yeah, yeah. We were, we're hooping. We're they're we're like, hooping. I think the Lakers can give them a shot. It's like last year we swept them. Yeah. So well, I, they were saying they. I think they were actually giving the Nuggets respect. Oh, they were, were they? They were saying they were saying they can beat any team but the Nuggets out of the West. Which I understand. I, agree. I understand that argument from, I agree. A, from a Laker fan. Yeah, I mean, I just can't. I can't wait to get it going. Um, we'll probably be back in Denver just probably for the finals. Finals, maybe even maybe even conference into the maybe finals. A, maybe a game here and there, in, just in the playoffs. I can't freaking wait. Yeah, can't wait. I actually really hope they play the Clippers to the Lakers just so we can go when we're here. Oh, true. That'd be yeah, awesome. Yeah, and I'm not scared of either of them at all. I'd actually say I'm more scared of the Clips. 
I'm not just, I'm just not scared. I'm, but I'm not scared. Like, imagine, not, like, could you see a world where we lose to the Clippers? No, I couldn't. I actually Maybe. definitely couldn't. Um, all right, let's get right into questions. questions here. Yeah. All right, this one comes from Swaggy C. Sick name. Swaggy it is C. A, yeah, that's a sweet name. I wonder if that's his government. I would assume it is. I mean, if it's his Snapchat name, that probably, that's, that's usually your government name. That's yeah. usually how that goes. He said, favorite memory from a sports game you were at? Um... I mean, it's it might just like be winning the finals. I think it is, but it's not like a specific memory from that game. But I mean, the, the I specific memory is the moment when, when they won. How that game was so weird because it yeah. it didn't feel like we were like I I always imagined that moment and I it just was like oh we're just gonna win and then we won and then everyone was I feel like everyone was like oh we won yeah I don't, like it's nobody like, now knew what how to do? act yeah yeah I was like trying to force myself to cry I don't know about yeah, you yeah, yeah. I wasn't, but did you? Did you? I I, I forced some out. Yeah. Oh, you cried a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I. But it was like it was, it was very like forceful. A, it was a business. Cry. It wasn't an emotional. It was cry. a business cry. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause I, I was always like, damn, I'm gonna definitely sob when we win, and I was just like, yeah, it wasn't gonna happen. Right. And so you forced one out. I forced one. I business cried in high school when, uh, in choir when we were like all saying goodbye. It was like the last day, and everyone was crying because like we were all gonna go to college. And you business cried. Yeah, cause I just I was definitely I was, I was like I'm gonna miss my friends, but I couldn't cry, and everyone was crying, so I business cried. I like try to That's think. So I just tried to get really sad. And what, you, what, do you, what did you I think forced about? It out. Um, I think I just forced the issue. I was like, "You're yeah. never gonna see these." Yeah, people. Yeah, like yeah. I really, I was like, "Dude, cry." Yeah, I was like, "Like where else?" I've, I've definitely business. That, that's a good question. Let's try to think of where where, where we else business, we business cried. cried. Um, where do you business cry? Where so business you? cry. You want to business cry when it's it. You should be crying. Yeah, that's when you want to do it. Because like you don't have to do it for a sad movie. Yeah, I don't think I've really ever business cried. Other than that, I might business cry at your wedding. Actually, you could business cry. Yeah, you you'll either real cry or just you'll have to business. Cry. Well, here's the thing: is you know what? I'll probably business cry because I, I I'm like, I I I keep saying I'm probably gonna cry. It's the then, same thing with the Nuggets. I'm like I I'm gonna cry, and then and then I'm, he didn't, and, and so then I was like cry. I'm not feeling it. So like if yeah, I'm yeah, yeah. you ever like what what's up with injury crying? Injury crying, pain cry is crazy. Pain cry, I don't pain cries. I feel like crying. I'm I'm like when I don't I'm know. crying. I'm actually sad. You know, I'm like not you pain like, cry more when you're you pain cry more when you're younger, but you could still pain cry as, as an adult. I think, and I think you're kind of just trying to sound the alarms when you're a kid. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're just trying to say like, "This hurts, mom." Yeah, like I, I got cut. You're like you're like noisy crying. Right. You're just sending an alert. Right. But good question, man. I've, I've also I, I also loved like the UFC event. I know we talk about UFC a lot, but that was just like that was just a sick event. Yeah. Sick event. I went to the Stanley Cup Finals and we lost Game Five. That was not, that's crazy. Not great. Yeah. But they won that year. They won the next game. Sucks. This is from Evan Schultz. Well, how do you say this last name? S H U L Z. Is it Schultz? Schultz. Schultz. Yeah. Where's the T? S H U L Schultz. Like S H U L Schultz. 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 I guess Schultz is what it should. Be. That's like Andrew Schultz. I know, but what, how do you say Schultz? You say Schultz or say Schultz? I don't know. I think people say I don't know. I because I've heard Andrew Schultz. Andrew Schultz. Let's go Schultz. I always say Schultz as well. Will you guys watch every second, including commercials? Can't go on phone of your favorite hockey team's NHL season for 100K. It's a really you interesting to, line that he set. For 100K. So you have to watch every single minute of the entire season? And you just sit down. You can't. You have to watch the commercials. I mean, the answer is, is going to be yes, because it's just... Probably, yeah. It's a lot of time, but it's just like three... You work for like three hours a day. And our team happens to be the best team in hockey. Yeah, yeah. We, so just, we would just get really into it. We would. We would. Yeah, We I also went to that yes. game the other day, and it was really freaking fun. It was super fun to watch, yeah. Braden says, where's the merch, little bros? Um... Braden, it's um it's actually off the shop. Um we'll do we'll do um we'll we'll do another drop soon. We just we're not focused on we wanna when we drop merch, we wanna like drop merch. Yeah, so the thing with the merch is we're the last batch that we dropped was drop shipped. Yeah. Which means that there wasn't a, a set quantity of the merch. Correct. And that's just not. I don't. I don't. I don't think that you can make the best quality when you're when you're. You can't make the best quality. It's like, like I, I want It wasn't not. Good, it's good quality, but it's like, like I want it to be like, like, like kind of limited. That's not drop shipped, you know. Yeah, and I kind of want it to be like limited, where it's like, like valuable to get one of the pieces. Yeah. You know what I really want is just like, like a shirt like this, where you you get like a really high quality material. Yeah. And we just get like two hundred or whatever, mm -hmm. and we just customize them. Is that an SR? No, that's uh, a Snoop. This is an SR, actually. Oh, it is an SR. That's yeah. a sweet a little SR. Nashville, little Nashville tee here. Um, I like that tee, though. Yeah, but I, 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 I don't want to. I don't want to force the merch out. Um, yeah, I agree. I agree. Like, I, yeah, like we could put the shop back up. I just don't. I just don't like that. I don't know. I want to fully do it. Yeah, do same. It. Yeah, so we'll do it soon. 
Like Jeremy Shannon says something that I, I just can't even really decipher what's going on. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you this question and just see, you know, if you could pull up an answer. Okay. Who's your starter? Right side mouth or left side bench or the rookie front teeth? <laughs> Love the pod boys. Thank you, Shannon. So right side of your Jeremy mouth, left Shannon. side of your mouth, and then- No, no, no. Who no. is the third piece? You got, who's your starter is the question mm -hmm. at hand. Right side mouth or left or left side bench mm -hmm. or rookie front teeth? Left side bench starts for me. Okay. That makes a lot of sense to me. Oh, what was really? His name? What was his name? That was Jeremy Shannon. But you, Jeremy, and, Jer makes, you and Jer are like- Yeah, I know. I know Jer like pretty, pretty well. Okay. Um, yeah, left side bench, Jer. Um, Good answer, Zach. If you just want to pick one, I mean, probably just say. Left, I would left, say, say left side. Bench. Left side bench. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's that's definitely my starter. Bryson said, "Hello, gentlemen. My name is Bryson." Hello, that's Bryson. A, that's a good start. Hi, Bryson. Now we know his name's Bryson too. That's a good point. That's a good. That's a really good point on on how to introduce yourself. That's, say your name. It's a good way to do it because then they know your name. Yeah. Right? Uh, what are yeah. your thoughts on the OJ situation? He was talking a lot of stuff on Twitter about Apple Juice, saying he wasn't that's the staple of the league. Hmm. This is just an update for the sticks. Yeah, I mean, I saw it on Twitter. I didn't. I'm not actually um, on Twitter. Yeah, so he was saying that AJ wasn't the staple. I, I mean, I get it. I think I think if you talk like Mount Rushmore, it probably goes to OJ. For like the juice that's on the Mount Rushmore, it's probably OJ. Mm -hmm. I think AJ's the stronger juice. I think he's he's the new era. Yeah. So they both have a point. I mean, this is juice though. Like this yeah. is juice. Like yeah. uh, juices are very competitive. Very competitive. Like that. Like I I have no problem with it. I I think OJ should think he's a staple. I think AJ should think he's a staple. Right. Right. And and I I, I think. And I, but I don't think either one is wrong. That's my thing. Exactly. I, don't, I think they're both good juices. Right. I think they they have different strengths. And if if there's no competition in the juice game, that we're gonna, we're going to see the juice game get a lot weaker. So right. a lot weaker. Yeah. We sh you know obviously it's it's. Not the best look or the best message for young juice to yeah to like to like get just, on each other and not respect each exactly. other exactly right. Um, but I think in the grand scheme of juice, it's the right it's the and right. We thing. saw and when when pineapple juice was like he wanted to just be buddy buddy. He's out of the big three. It doesn't work. So like exactly. <laughs> so it's like that's not really the way that you you got to be competitive at some point. And you're never gonna be the you're never gonna you're never gonna satisfy everybody. No, you no, know, no. Um, I mean, some people want the juices to all coexist. Some want some of them to beef. I mean, either way, it just it, it, Danny, it never ends well. For sure, for sure. The Officer SpongeBob. That's a good question from Cam. Cam, probably Cam. Cam. I just read it as Cam because her mom's Cam, and it says K A M. Wait, so what? How did oh, you read that Cam. name? Cam. 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 Yeah. Cam or Cam? K A M is Cam. Are you saying the same thing twice? Cam and then Cam, like Cameron, Cammy. So Cam, Cammy. Cam or Cam, you know what I'm Cam, saying? Yeah, I think it's the like same. Like if you shorten Cammy and if you shorten Cameron, you'll say Cam and then you'll say Cam. Yeah, I got them. I, I, I'm clocking them both as the same thing. Uh, yeah, the office, I, I've got I mean, the office personally. They're just different because like, it's kind of like a kid show, SpongeBob. I'd probably still go to the office though. Yeah. But I, that might be my favorite show. It probably is my favorite show. I do think SpongeBob developed some, some great characters though. Yeah, like, like Sponge and Pat are so- You love them. Yeah, you do. You just want to watch them. And they're just eight, they're just contact. freaking A-list celebrities. They are. Guys. They freaking are. I had one um from Instagram that I yeah, here it is. Question for the pod. This is from Braden Wright. Uh he said, What's more likely? Rockies lose hundred and ten games or the Avs win the cup? And that was from and That's said, good and said question. a fellow Denver sports fan. I I mean, I don't think it's a good question at all. I think the Rockies are gonna are gonna have a winning season. What's the record? Um I was saying, I think they're going to have a winning season. I don't think we have to look at right now. But think, what's their record right now? I think now, we have though. to look at the the strides. I think we won today. I think we have to look at the strides. How many games have we lost and how many we games have we won? We need to look at how... Oh, we fucking lost today. Damn it, dude. We were up 3-2. Here's kind of a general rule of thumb. We're 3-10. And, and, and what, what, was this, what was this fellow's name? Um, Braden. Braden understands this. If you're a Denver sports fan, you get it. If there's a day, right? If if it's say say, you know, such as a Wednesday or a Thursday or maybe even, hell, a Monday... Yeah, or Denny. Sunday, Saturday, any day, the Rockies probably lost. Right? That's just kind I, of the rule of thumb. I think it's like that through thirteen games. But I think a lot of the games we've lost too. Like we lose five three, we lose four two. We lo I, I think we're gonna have a winning season. You know, you did call so, the Broncos turning it around. We yeah, didn't end up yeah. fully turning it around, but you you were on that train. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna count your Rockies out. This then. is more of like a blind faith train. I, I'll be honest. Yeah, I'll be honest. But um. I think if we're actually reading the question though, I, I think that those are the odds are it's very actually, similar. It's good. I'm gonna go Avs win the cup. Is Same. more is more likely. I would agree. I'm just gonna root for the, the winning side of it. But it is that is a very good question. That is a very good question. Yeah. Um this one comes from Thomas. 
uh, really, it's a really interesting question. He said, hey, boys, love the pod. Another question about Zach's big day. Given that Zach is the superstar of that day, are you guys taking into account the amount of stress that <laughs> that will have on him? Yeah. Because it is such a huge accomplishment for him. I just worry about him getting anxious about everything. Yeah, so and if you if you don't know what Zach's big uh Zach's big day is, it's um so my wedding day, Zach's best man speech is called Zach's Big Day. It's Zach's Big Day. It's hard to say. Mm -hmm. Um it's gonna be an hour long Netflix special filled with um, as Zach says, comedy, raunchiness, and honesty. Yeah. Um, and it's a really important day. I, I wasn't able to get tickets for his best man speech for my wedding. And I'm, I'm so freaking annoyed about yeah, that. I'm sorry I, that you weren't able to. I'm not going to be able to tickets. go. Um, yeah. That's annoying. That's annoying. Yeah. So I'm not going to be able to go to, to that speech on my wedding day, but, um, that's what he's talking about there. Yeah. It's going to be a very big day for you. Yeah. I, I, I really appreciate you for reaching out, Thomas. Um, yeah, it's a big day and, and that's why they, that's why they named it that I, um, I do know, you know, how much is going to be on my shoulders that day, mm -hmm. um, and I'm just trying to not think about it. A lot of like really. logistics things. To there's get a, sorted. yeah, there's a lot of planning that goes into it, and and into Zach's big day. Yeah, yeah. and I, I think if you if you think too much about it, you know, you um, you psych yourself out a little right. bit. So you know, with something as big as as you know, my comedy special, you know, that will be on your wedding day, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. it. I think it'll be at the it'll be at my wedding uh, during my dinner. Yeah, it like is. your best it man is. speech. Yeah. It's just going to be surreal. I don't know. It's surreal. You, it's a yeah. surreal moment for me. Yeah, it's yeah. I, I can't. It's hard to put into words. Like, I don't know, man. It, it's 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 tough. It's just tough. Yeah, it's yeah. tough. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Of course, I'm nervous a little bit. Um, but that's normal. That's normal for sure. Um, no, that it, and if you need any help with any like planning stuff, like thanks. I know that's a lot. So yeah, yeah just let me know. Yeah, if you thank need you. Anything. Thank yeah. you. No, yeah, for sure. Seriously, for sure. Kristen just says chocolate versus cheese. Oh, I saw that. That's a that's a very interesting question. They play in two very different divisions. But that's a re but they're really they're freaking competitive. Yeah, yeah. That's a freaking that's like um you know what that's like is that's like a UFC guy fighting a boxer. Yeah, like they're, like they're playing in different leagues. Um, do we know is this in the octagon or is this in the in the the square circle? Well, the thing is, Danny, I think that it's going to be kind of like a square circle. They call it like a square circle. It's called a square circle, and for boxing, the, it, ring the square ring. Square circle ring. They, ring. they always do square and circle in the same sentence. I don't know what it is. I don't know. Um, it's close though. Cheese and chocolate. I think, but it's I close. think the way they're going to do it, it's going to be like back and forth, home field, home field. You know what I'm saying? Seven gamer. Yeah, seven gamer. I think I have cheese just because you need it. You I think I was going to do cheese too. I think it's just a little bit more crucial. A little bit more versatile. Um, yeah, and when you're a sweet, that's the issue you're going to run into with these with these um these versatile um you know savory players. Right. 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 Um, so I'd probably go cheese as well. I think it goes seven though. I think it's cheese. I think it's cheese and seven. I think it's cheese and seven. This is a really, a really freaking good question from Ridge Chart Land. He said, "How many times do you think you could say onion before you mess up?" Oh, I saw that. Um, like a hundred. I mean, I'll give it a go right now. Okay. Onion, 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 onion. Should I keep playing? Go. Onion, 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 onion. I am getting fatigued. Onion, 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 onion. I forgot what the word means. Onion, 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 onion. Onion, 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 onion. All right, Tom. All right, all right, all right. He proved it. He proved it. Dude, you know what's crazy? You would never mess up. Think about insane. What did Mr. Beast do? Was he saying Logan Paul? Like for like for like a hundred thousand times. So like I was already like going nuts, like going crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. That's insane that he did that. Who's better at golf, Zach? Zach's better at golf. From Nolan. Yeah, I mean, listen, we. I think a lot of sports were like very similar. I think golf, you're just better at. So there's that. Nothing else to say about that. Right? And we're about to start golfing again. So I would love to get good. I would love to get good. I think you could get good in like 30 minutes. <laughs> like, I don't know about that. But I don't think it would take... It's probably just like a little bit of form adjustment. It's just like adjust the stroke and then... I'm not bad. I think I'm like a... Oh, you're good. I think I'm above average a little bit. Yeah. I'm a little... Uh, I don't even know. I'm a little above average. Well, if we're talking about... But like... like if we're talking about everybody in the world, I'm like top really 1%. Good. That actually is true. Like I watched like... Uh, I don't even want to, I don't want to shit on the guy, but I just watched like a golf video and I was like, this guy is so bad at golf. Yeah. And it's like, I'm better than that guy. Yeah. I mean that, but the, I mean, most people just have never swung a golf club and they would look terrible. And, they, and like they we, wouldn't be able to make contact. 
Right, and like a lot of people don't have any hand eye. Yeah, and it's like we play sports. Yeah, but then if you're talking about people that like golf and shit, then I'm like bottom tier. Yeah, yeah. People that golf, I, I, I kind of envy them because they, you, you just, I feel like once you learn to just be like a, a five handicap, you just always have it. Yeah, it's so awesome. That actually is awesome. I want to just learn you it. Just kind of have. You're just good. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It is like the most like guaranteed you're just going to be good yeah. every round we got ryan he said do you think oreo is really milk's favorite cookie or is it just a part of milk's marketing contract it's really really it's like very blurred yeah it's blurry because they uh, they do have a signed agreement mm -hmm. and that's on record um but then oreo is like no i really really do love milk so it's like a really but what do you like is he supposed to say that i think the answer danny i think the answer is it started as a business I mean, milk thing loves oreo yeah. it started as a business thing and then they they became actually they they became buds. So you don't, but I don't. I just have a hard time believing that Oreo is milk's favorite cookie. I, I no, I I I think it's freaking. I think it's chocolate chip cookie is milk's favorite cookie. Danny, I think it was just a match made in heaven. I, I think that they were forced. You think to that's get, milk's favorite cookie. I think legit. that they were put in a room together, and and it's just like they spend so much time together, man. Eventually, you're going to become buddies. You're going to fall in love. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah. and and to be honest with you, Danny, they 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 work really well together, and I know that makes everybody yeah. that that. You know that ships chocolate and and milk, mm -hmm. chocolate chip cookie and milk. I, I'm yeah, and I'm I'm like a. You stan. ship them? I'm a stan. Yeah, I mean, I'm listen, one I, of the, I'm one of those like cult fans. Of, for, and for those people, it it is annoying because. And I will like, say for those people, stop commenting on Oreo stuff. Stop, stop. It's it's just it's it's honestly stop it's, saying it, like stop commenting on milk stuff like like uh, where's or like it's just weird. enough. Just stop. They they're 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 cookies and milk like the, you know they they have a, a a personal life outside of. And I saw Milk got stopped by the paparazzi because Milk was working with Chocolate Chip Cookie. Yeah. And they were like, are you an Oreo? Does that mean you guys have beef? No, just No, stop. just grow up. Okay. Look, they can all be friends. Yeah, we can, they, they can, can all, all be exist. friends. Um, but I do I do think he raises a really good question. It is, um, you know, it's it's something that we'll never really know the answer to, Danny. Yeah. Because um, the contract is signed. So it's like, it's hard to know. It, it, it to exists. Know. And, yeah. and those yeah. tape, th those, those, those papers leaked. So yeah, like, yeah they did. We Twitter. know that that's real. Yeah. It's legit. Yeah. You know, wh know, whether you want to believe him or not, that's on you. Right. Jake said after Chuck's retirement, do you think he chucked enough wood that he would get in the wood chucking hall of fame? I think Chuck will be fine. I think he'll be in the hall. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I think he chucked a significant amount of wood, you know, yeah. his yeah. efficiency. That's another conversation for sure. Um, but if we're just going to talk sheer wood, I mean, he, he had chucked that, a lot. Yeah. And we've seen guys do this. He just, his, his philosophy was just chuck as much as you yeah. can. Because some people do like quantity chucks, some people do more quality chucks, right? And you could be a, a quality chucker and go to the Chuck Hall of Fame as well, mm -hmm. right? It's just what, whatever. Two type different of play styles. You are. I mean, yeah. he was a volume chucker, and, and for sure, he you know he put up a lot of chucks. You know, mm -hmm. he chucked a lot of wood. Mm -hmm. um, and lower then, shooting, lower chucking percentage. Very low chuck percentage. Yeah, um, and that was the caveat. But he was still a chuck star 100%, every year. A hundred percent. He's a perennial so, chuck star. Perennial chuck star. I, I think it would be ridiculous to say he's not going to be in the Hall of Fame. I agree. I agree. I think he'll be fine. I think he'll be in the hall. I think he'll be first ballot. Um, I, I hope so, man. I freaking hope so. Here's an interesting thing. I was going to put this in news, but um, I forgot. Mm. So Drew Holiday just signed an extension with the Celtics, like Saw a four-year. Four um, Saw that. And I thought it was interesting. Like, there's a type of player in the NBA. There's like superstars. Mm -hmm. There's role players. And then there's the in-between. Drew Holiday is like definition of in-between. Yeah. Um, I called them part stars. There's all stars there because they're only part all yeah. stars. So I called them part stars. Drew Holiday, who Dejounte Murray, Dejounte Murray is a good one. You know who the best part star is of all time? Draymond Rudy, Green, Rudy Gay, Rudy Gay, Andre Iguodala. Oh, Andre Iguodala. Al Jefferson, Paul Millsap. Paul Millsap is a good one. Marcus Camby, Richard uh, Jefferson. Richard Jefferson was on there. I've Lamar Odom. Yep. Jason Terry. Jason Terry. Part stars. C.J. McCollum. C.J. McCollum never made an All Star game. He's really fucking good, dude. I, he is almost like, even though he's not an all-star, he's almost just a star star. Yeah, he's so good. Um, um, Mike Bibby. Mike Bibby for sure. Um, Damn, I'm trying to Jamal think of Crawford today who are, who are part stars. Let's think. I mean, Aaron Gordon. Aaron Gordon's a part star. Um, like, honestly, Rudy Gobert is just an all-star, but he's more of a part star. You can be an all- Like, because Drew Holiday is like a two-time all-star. Yeah, but I think star. Rudy Gobert is like an all-star every year for some reason. Which yeah, I don't, that's interesting. Al just Horford. Like, Al Horford's a part star. Yeah. No, that's um, good. Just interesting. All right. This isn't a question, but this is just like a suggestion. I think it's so funny. I don't know if this is like actually possible. If you're living in Florida, tell us. It says, Sub Boys, you, also call, you, should, you should call Gatorland in Florida or more local wildlife sanctuaries about racing a squirrel. 
I bet you can make it happen. Oh, I want to do that. <laughs> yeah. So we did a would you rather. It's like, would you rather a million or like 10 million to beat a squirrel on a hundred meter? I actually really want to do that race. Dude, imagine if we actually did that. I want to do it. I don't think- like, that, how, would get, that would go really viral, I think too. I, it would only go viral if we could figure out we how to get to, the squirrel to actually run. I don't think that's possible. I think we just get the squirrel- we put up, I think we put up little walls and we just put like food at the, like, there's gotta be a way to do it. We put food at the end of the hundred meter. And <laughs> I guess if we got food. clear walls. Yeah. And they just, so, or, but they're like this high, so they're not going to jump out. Yeah. And we just put them in there and we give them like treats at the end. Or we do like a trail of food. Uh, yeah. But then they're going to stop and take all the food. I think we just make it really like, like treats that you could smell from a hundred away. I mean, if, if we could make it happen to be the best thing of all time. I think I'm winning that race too. I think, but if they if they really if they dart they probably win. I think if they dart they win. I don't think that there's a, a scenario where they dart where down they 100 dart. meters. But yeah. if they did, I don't know. That would be so funny. That's really all we got for this one. Yeah, that'll do it. Uh, Epi twenty. Love you guys. Love y'all.